everyone hope you're all doing well um, last week my daughter Emma moved in well the weekend actually my daughter um, Emma and her partner moved into their new home and um, I'm absolutely shattered at the moment oh it's been a real slog but um, so Thursday she wanted to go to Basingstoke to buy a few homey bits for the house and I um, grabbed a lift off of her to go to Basingstoke with her to get a few crafty bits so I thought I would share um, my little bargains with you show you what I got so I'll get straight on and I went, we went to home uh, Hobbycraft and um, this last week Hobbycraft were doing a bit of a bargain deal with the car blanks so I buy car blanks because I just find it easier um, to just grab them out when I want to make some cards and these ones are normally five pounds for a pack of 50 and they're five by seven inches they are 250 gsm the actual blank car blanks themselves and then 100 gsm for the envelopes and um, these were reduced from five pound to two pound fifty so i got myself three packs they only had them in white they didn't have the ivory ones um this time but i just thought i will grab those and they'll do me i sure i know I'll, you know I'm, i use so many car blanks it's so that's why the first bargain and then i got these two little steel dies which i thought were pretty cute one is a fairy and the other one is a peacock and a peacock feather so i thought they'd make some quite nice embellishments for card making um and they were two pound fifty each so it looks like hobby craft has started doing these these are a new little thing with their paper crafting um section and i had loads of new papers in there as well actually it looks like they've i did get an email from them saying how you know they've got all these new paper craft um items in there but i've got so much paper i not allowing myself to buy well I say that <laughs> I did buy some paper on Thursday but not not um, designer papers so that's Hobbycraft done then we went into um, oh, where was this uh, home bargains oh yeah we went into home bargains and in home bargains I got I picked up three of these little um, clear sort of uh, make makeup bags, I suppose they are. But I use these all the time. I love these. I love anything clear. I love clear storage. But I use them for ah. so like this big one. This was um, Tesco's did an offer ages and ages ago. There were three in one inside one bag and they were reduced from five pounds to 250 so i got them but i keep all my glitters and glitter glues in this big one and then in a, the smaller one that came with that set i keep all my fabric um these are fabric dies and fabric pens so i keep those in there and this is the same similar sort of size to these ones so when i saw these i thought yeah i know I'll definitely find something to put in these and they were 89 pence each so they were my first little bargain then I picked up these are staples of card making for me these ones are silver little um, pearl dots I suppose you'd call them they're sticky ones they've got sticky on the back these ones are um, actually pearl I've got two lots of pearl and one lot of silver silver pearl and I, I get through so many of these when I'm card making and they were they're just 59 pence each in home bargain so I always try and pick those up when I go in there if I can if they if they've got them in um I also got two packs of um double-sided sort of um oh, crack what mine's gone blank now you know um dimensional stick sticky stickers and how many it's 320 double sided in each pack so I've got two of those and they were 69 pence each and then finally um, these um, alphabet stickers they glitter 
there's 10 sheets and that was 69 pence as well so I thought that was quite a good bargain and I know I'll use those for something card making probably but you know so that was home bargains then I we briefly popped into the range um, I didn't get much in the range I needed some more clear embossing powder and this is paper mania and in the range it was 2 99 so that was cheaper than Hobbycraft so I got that in there and also the red tape which I love this stuff um, when I'm putting pockets in my books and things like that this is really really strong tape so I got two different sizes I got six millimeter and three millimeter I actually got the wrong size I meant to get I meant to pick up this one which I'm not sure that must be I'm guessing that's 10 millimeters that was the size I meant to get um, well I meant to get the six millimeter but I wanted to get the 10 millimeter as well but anyway I got those two and they were 149 each so again I'm pretty sure that was cheaper than the, um, than Hobbycraft that's why I got them in the range so that was the range then finally we went into B&M Home Bargains and this is not sort of craft related at all but I just thought it was a bargain I picked up nine um, these are Yankee Candles they smell gorgeous this is Stony Cove mmm they're so nice and I was running out of little vo votives so I thought I'll get those they were 89 pence each so it was eight pound and a penny for the for all um, nine of those so that was a massive bargain because I don't know what price Yankee Candles are all around the world but they are really expensive in England so that was a major bargain they obviously make those specially for uh, B&M b &M, so yay for that um, I picked up these really pretty um, little um, thickers, gorgeous they are, and they were £1.49 for, it's a, it's a double, it's two, two sheets of them, they're alphabet ones, but they're really pretty designs, I really like those, so yeah, so that's £1, was it £1.49, because sometimes, the, yeah it was £1.49, so that was a bargain, also picked up this Bostic um, glue pen. It's fine and wide. It's got fine one end and wide the other. It was one ninety nine, so it wasn't a bargain or anything. But I just thought I'll give it a try, see what it's like. Um, it might coming might be quite nice for doing, um, you know, when you're doing the little uh, die cuts and things. So I'm going to give that a try. So that was one ninety nine. Now this particular purchase the next one I'm a little bit naffed off about because in my last haul I think it was my last haul anyway I, I don't know if you remember but I needed some black card because I had to I was not working on a project I was making some um, um, banners I was making a banner and I needed black cardstock for that banner so I was in Hobbycraft I picked the card up in Hobbycraft it was I can't remember how many sheets it was 40 or 50 sheets, probably 50 sheets for a fiver. I found this last week in B&M. Black cardstock, 210 GSM for 199 and it's 40, 40 sheets. So I know I already bought some, but I thought, well, you know what, I'm gonna I'm gonna get that because black you, you'll always use black cardstock for something, so um, and I thought it was such a good price. And the thing is, when you go into places like B&M and, and Home Bargains, you never know what stock they're going to have in. So I just thought, if I get that, it might not be there next time I go. So I've got it now. And then the last thing I got, my final bargain, was this A3 coloured cardstock. So got a variety of colours in there. Um, it's 210 GSM. And that again, that was one ninety nine. So nice big sheets of of coloured cardstock. So I'm really pleased with that. There's twenty sheets in there. Um, and I, again, I'm sure I'll really find something to use that with. But that was a good price. I couldn't sort of resist that really at one ninety nine. So that is all of my purchases that I got last week. Um, and 
that's all I've got to show you this week I'm afraid because I've been so busy with um, helping Emma move in but I hope that hope you enjoyed sharing my um, bargains with me and um, I'll see you again soon thanks everybody for watching thank you bye bye